So now you're getting ready for the experience of yoga nidra. And you're becoming more comfortable as you lie down in Shavasana, in resting pose. Really just make all the adjustments you need so that you're completely comfortable and cozy. You might want to keep your feet slightly apart, let them flop out a little bit sideways. Allowing your arms to be slightly away from your body with the palms upward. And just adjusting yourself like you would in any posture or asana so that you have no physical discomfort and you can lie down and practice yoga nidra without moving. Of course, the phone is ringing. So if your eyes aren't closed yet, allow your eyes to gently close, letting the upper lid rest on the bottom lid. The practice of Yoga Nidra is the act of hearing and the act of feeling. You will function on the level of awareness plus the level of listening. In dreams, you have no control often. In Yoga Nidra, you are the creator of the dream. and remind yourself mentally that I will not sleep. I will listen to the voice. I will not sleep. I will listen to the voice. Give yourself this time to become calm and steady, taking a deep breath in. And as you exhale, feel calmness spreading throughout the body. And say to yourself, relax. I am relaxing now. You're aware of the sounds in the distance. You're aware of the sounds close by. It may be your heartbeat or the ticking of the clock or the wind outside the window. Allow your hearing to move from sound to sound without attempting to identify anything.
and gradually bring your awareness to remembering what the room is like that you're in without opening your eyes. Imagine the four walls, the ceiling, the floor, your body lying down, maybe even seeing your body lying down on the floor. Become aware of the existence of your physical body lying on the floor in perfect stillness. Develop awareness of the physical meeting between your body and the floor. Become aware of your natural breath. Become aware of the deep, natural, spontaneous breath. And know that throughout the practice, your body is breathing. And now say to yourself mentally, I am going to practice yoga nidra. I will not sleep. I am going to practice yoga nidra. And then remember your sankalpa, your resolve. Try to do it from memory as you wrote it or as you work with your sankalpa. And when you find the words, state the resolve three times mentally with complete awareness and feeling towards that resolve. We'll begin now the rotation of consciousness where you'll hear different parts of the body move the mind as quickly as possible, jumping from point to point, repeating mentally the part or following it in your mind's eye. We begin with the right hand. Focus awareness on the right hand. The right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, right thigh, knee, calf muscle, ankle, heel, sole, top of the foot, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. Now moving awareness to the left hand, left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, fifth finger, 
palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, lower arm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, armpit, waist, hip, left thigh, knee, calf muscle, ankle, heel, sole, top of the foot, left big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, fifth toe. And now awareness of the right shoulder, awareness of the left shoulder, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, right hip, left hip, awareness of the whole spine from the neck to the base of the spine, the whole spine together. And now become aware of the top of the head, the forehead, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, eyebrow center, right eyelid, left eyelid, right eye, left eye, right ear, left ear, right cheekbone, left cheekbone, nose, tip of the nose, right nostril, left nostril, upper lip, lower lip, chin, jaw, throat, right collarbone, left collarbone, right side of the chest, left side of the chest, middle of the chest, navel center, abdomen, lower abdomen. Become aware of the whole of the right leg the whole left leg, awareness of both legs together, awareness of the right arm, of the left arm, of both arms together. Of the whole back, of the whole of the front of the body, the wholeness of the head together, legs, arms, back, front, head, feet, sides, together, the whole of the body together. the whole of the body together, the whole of the body together. Become aware of the whole body and the space the body occupies. Aware of the body and the space that is occupied by your body. Body and space.
Become aware of the whole body and the floor. The whole body in relation to the floor. And at the same time, aware of how different points of the body are in contact with the floor. Feel the meeting points between the back of your head and the floor. The back of your hands and the floor. The back of your legs and the floor. The back of your heels and the floor. Awareness of all the meeting points between the body and the floor. Begin to become aware of the breath. Drawing your attention now to your natural incoming and outgoing breath. Feel the breath moving along the passage between the navel and the throat. On inhalation, the breath rises from the navel center to the throat center. On exhalation, the breath descends from the throat center to the navel center. Become completely aware of the breath. Navel to throat, throat to navel, just awareness. Maintain your awareness and at the same time, start counting your breaths backwards as follows. I am breathing in 27. I am breathing out 27. I am breathing in 26. I am breathing out 26. I am breathing in 25, I am breathing out 25, and so on from 27 to 1, counting to yourself mentally as you follow the rise and fall of your breath from the navel center to the throat, from the throat to the navel center. Total awareness of breathing and counting. Slow and relaxed. And please stop counting now. Stop counting. And become aware of sensations in the body. Awaken to the feeling of heaviness in the body. As if the body is so heavy. 
it's sinking into the floor. Heaviness through the body, from the top to the bottom, whole body heavy. And then awareness of the feeling of lightness. Awakening to the feeling of lightness, like a feather. Weightlessness in all parts of the body. So light that the body feels like it's floating above the floor. Awareness of lightness. And then become aware of any feelings of discomfort or constriction or blockage, like a log blocking the natural flow of water in a stream. Become aware of this blockage, of a blocking of energy mentally or physically or emotionally. Feel and sense and awaken to feelings of block, of stoppage, of constriction. And then become aware of the feeling of complete joy and openness, a feeling of pleasure, physically or mentally, emotionally or spiritually. Feeling a sense of expansion and spaciousness, alive with joy throughout the body, mind, emotion and spiritual bodies. And then become aware of the third eye center between the eyebrows. Awareness of the space between the eyebrows, the eyebrow center. Bring your attention to the dark space you see or perceive in front of the closed eyes. Maybe you see this space in front as if you were looking at a screen, gazing slightly upwards towards this screen. watching the darkness that you see before you with detachment, just observing with witness consciousness. Begin to imagine and resting your mind 
in the idea that this darkness is warm and cozy and safe and friendly. If any subtle phenomena manifests, like colors or patterns, simply take note of them in your mind. If thoughts occur during this time of focus, let them come and go, but continue watching the dark space without attachment, observing like you would a screen of images. Gentle awareness to the eyebrow center. Begin to shift your awareness now to the heart center, to the space behind the chest, to the space behind the thymus gland, to the heart center, anahata. Let your mind rest in the safe sanctuary of the heart space with a sense of gratitude and joy and peace and calm. Think of it or imagine it in the color of golden and allow this golden energy to spread like butter over every part of yourself, inside and outside and all around your aura. A cleansing, protective, golden light, egg-shaped. And imagine it emitting from the center of your sacred spiritual heart sanctuary behind the physical heart. Imagine this golden light bringing healing and balance and positivity And begin to sense now the words that you used to create your sankalpa when you first began the practice. Just draw it forward into your memory as best as you can. Repeat it mentally to yourself with feeling three times.
Become aware now of your breathing, aware of the natural in and out breath. awareness of a sense of deep relaxation, awareness of your physical body in this space and time, awareness of your legs, your arms, your whole spine stretched out on the floor in Shavasana. aware of the meeting points of your whole body in relation to the floor. Awareness of the sounds in the room. Awareness of the sounds outside the room. Awareness of the space that you're resting in the four walls, the ceiling. Completely bring your mind to the external environment. And allow the awakening process to be gentle, like a newborn awakening from a long sleep. When you feel ready, not on my words, but on your cue. Begin to wiggle your fingers and toes, bringing your knees to your chest, resting on your side at some point, and then gradually sitting up with your eyes closed. So I'm going to suggest that you don't engage in any chatter, but that you spend some time just processing what may have come up for you during the practice. And then we can communicate at some other time. Thank you all for coming. Namaste. Namaste. Thank mm -hmm. you.